Hey everyone, this is Josh Galvin with Tizzish.com. On this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set up OnlyWire to basically be your automatic syndicator from your WordPress blog to all your social networks. So I'm already logged in into, um, you know, into someone's account right here. So that way we could go ahead and add, uh, the, I can show you how to do the setup and basically how it works with your WordPress system. All right, so before we begin though, here's what you need to understand. Your WordPress system, basically, you know, the, your Tizzish system already comes with, with OnlyWire installed on it. Where you find this is the following. Scroll down. So here's your login. What you want to do is scroll down to where it says settings and then click on OnlyWire settings. All right? So after you click on OnlyWire settings, you'll be on a page just like this. Now on this page here, this is where you're going to, the only thing you have to do to complete the setup is enter your OnlyWire username and password and then make sure that this one is the only one checked. Do not check this one off, all right? So basically, uh, we're going to go through one example setup after we just go through the steps that you have to do to do a full setup, all right? So just to remind you, do your, put your username and password for the same account that you set up here. And obviously, I'm already logged in, but you'll just sign up for an account. Basically, you put the same username and password here and then make sure this one's the only one checked. Look at what it says here. It only wire does not recommend en enabling this. So do not check this one. Keep this one unchecked. And then basically just leave all these buttons checked and then all you want to do is click on save changes. By doing that, your WordPress blog will be now synced with your only wire system. So that's the first step you want to do. It's really simple. Just enter your username and password. Now let's go to step two, which is actually make sure we set up OnlyWire properly on your computer because OnlyWire requires you to download their program and install it on your computer. So here's what I mean by that. Let's go ahead and log into your account. And then under here, when you're logged in, click on the button that says start. Here's what you want to do. You just want to pretty much follow these exact steps. But uh, here's the thing. You don't have to go through all four of these steps. The, pretty much the only one you have to do is number one number two and then number four the everything I just showed you with having WordPress having your this only wire system already built with your WordPress blog that is covered so number three is covered that's already done so what you want to do is first it's download the submitter alright and basically only wire has a video tutorial explaining what this is and their video tutorial is exactly the same as what I would show you but pretty much all this means is you download this plugin you already download this tool so watch let's click on download the submitter you're on a page here. You want to just download now. And then once see it's downloading on it's downloading right here on my on my screen down here. It's almost all set. And once once it fully downloads, all you have to do is the following. Just open the program. And then when you want to open the program, click on the click on the word that says run. And then what it's going to do, you're, not, you're only going to set this up one time, but it, it, it's important for you to understand the following. When you submit an OnlyWire post, you have to be logged into your OnlyWire account here. So meaning when you do a blog post in WordPress, what you're going to need to do is be logged into your OnlyWire account here and also have that OnlyWire program running that you had just installed on your computer. All right, so basically, wherever you installed it, just double click on that program, and what's gonna happen is on your computer, at the very bottom right of your of your browser window, my, my tutorial, my video tutorial can't go down there, but basically at the very bottom right next to the, next to the time and like the, and like all those other buttons at the hat that show up, there's a button that you could pull up that's your only wire button so here's what you here's what I mean by that actually so here I'm gonna I could actually I could move this this video so see here on the bottom right how there's an icon that says only wire submitter well all you have to do every time you're gonna post a WordPress blog post you're gonna need to do the following you're gonna need to make sure that this submitter exists and you're gonna right click on it put authorize accounts and all you're gonna do is enter the username of the same account that you're logged into so you see here on OnlyWire that I'm logged into this account named Bob Gibbs and you see the account here is named Bob Gibbs. All you gotta do is do this one time, click on done, and that's it. And all you have to do, we'll go over this shortly, but basically 
just make sure that this program is running is is open in the background when you submit a blog post we'll cover this shortly so let's just go back to our only wire and finish the setup all right so here we we download the we downloaded the submitter and we have it installed on a computer now what we want to do is set up your services so what that means is under services you have a list of all these social networks all right what you want to do is pretty much enter all the I, I gave you the list of all the social networks you should sign up with in the training center that's along with this tutorial so pretty much whatever the username and password for all the networks that I had put on there sign up for those alright and basically uh, all you're gonna do is after you sign up for them you're just gonna go ahead and click on save and then pretty much after hitting save you're all set because now at this point your only wire is fully set up and now your website's fully integrated because we had already done the password setup and syncing like I showed you at first so now let's go over the process of actually publishing a post and having it act actually syndicate through all the networks you have in integrated here okay so the first step is the following go into your WordPress section go to add a new post like you would normally do and then I'll wait for the posting screen to come up and here's the posting screen so Basically, I'm not going to do a real life publishing one just because this will go to all the networks of this site and I don't want to do that because it's a demo, it's just a test video. But basically, let's say if this is your blog post, test post just like normal, right? And then you're doing all your content like normal. Here's what you want to verify. When you scroll down, you see how there's you see how there's a button here that says only wire bookmark and share. Click this button here that says post this revision. Just make sure that's checked. All right, and then at this point, what you want to do, only do this for new postings. That's the key thing. Remember, don't do this for postings that have not been published yet or that have already been published. If you're editing the post, do not do this. The reason is is that you'll get marked from OnlyWire as spam, okay? Because if you're if you're sending revised postings, meaning let's say if this was published two weeks ago and all I did was edit some of the text and now I'm resubmitting it that's gonna be very spammy to only wire so make sure that you only check this on the first time you're publishing an article brand new don't do it for revisions that's important that's extremely important or else you'll be kicked out of most of the networks that only wire submits you to for spam reasons alright so basically after you do your blog post we click on check uh, we click on the check check mark now before you publish your article, verify the following. Verify that you're logged into OnlyWire.com. You'll know you're logged in simply because it'll say your username at the top. Now, that's the first step. Step number two is open that program that we opened earlier from your, from your desktop. It's, the, it's the, OnlyWire, the OnlyWire tool that you downloaded. So you're going to click on that tool. You're going to authorize accounts. And just make sure that the account, the same account is, is clicked on and just click on done. After you do that, you can now hit publish and you're all set. Now after you do that, here's one thing you can do, or here's something that will happen. What's going to happen is in your OnlyWire account, you're gonna, or just on your computer after you hit submit, you're going to have these boxes that may appear and have you fill in these certain keywords or that you're going to have to fill in these certain, um, uh, like yes, like security keywords called CAPTCHA pretty much to verify postings when those boxes come up I don't have I can't show you on this tutorial but you'll know what I'm talking about right when you see it it's those funky little characters that you get to verify to make sure you're a human and not just a robot spamming someone those boxes will come up you may have like three or four of them so keep that in mind after you publish a posting on WordPress that before you close WordPress and before you close OnlyWire what you may want to do is come to where it says history in your OnlyWire account and just hang out here for you know keep this open for five minutes or so because what you're gonna see is a list of all the postings of your WordPress post going to all of your networks and when you see this list pretty much just um, look at the lightning that fills up and then basically fill the captures as they come up you might have like three or four depending it really depends so um, keep that in mind and after you do that in history you'll see all your postings successfully went through then you can pretty much close this out all right, so that's pretty much everything on using OnlyWire properly with your WordPress system. If you have any questions, go to facebook.com forward slash tizish, the way you see it spelled here, and ask me there. All right, well, good luck and take care.